what is up youtube i am mm. 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 okay <laughs> what is up youtube i am back with another video if you have already subscribed i really appreciate y'all so much i'm so close to 100 so thank you so if you're one of my subscribers welcome back to my channel and if you're new Thank you for tuning in. I am here with my daughter, Naya. <laughs> She's talking about some period. I'm, um, I actually just got off work. I know you, I don't know. People say it's, it's illegal to drive with this light on, but I want to record today because I'm, I'm, I, I really feel, I feel creative. I feel creative today. But yeah, so I'm actually about to get ready to go to the store um, and just get something quick, something cheap to eat. Because again, if you watched my last video, homegirl don't got all them stamps that y'all be getting. I wish I did. I wish I did so, 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 so bad. I mean, yes, it is a blessing. But at the same time, it's a curse too. Because baby, I'm tired of spending my little coins. But yeah, we are on our way to Publix. Once I get there, I will be back. Bye. Okay, so we are, we actually just arrived at Publix. I know I just said I don't got no food stamps and I'm spending cash and I chose to come to the highest store. The highest store in Tampa. So yeah. I'm about to get ready to first let me come to produce first because I need an onion and a bell pepper for what I'm about to make Most for a minute. Uh -huh. No, come this way because I want to get an um, onion and a bell pepper. So yeah, I'm about to get an onion and a bell pepper. And, oh, wait a minute. Let me come right here because I said I wanted to get some Cuban bread. Surprisingly, they have some. I'm looking for some Cuban bread without them little seeds on them, though. Thing. None of this is the stuff I'm looking for. Just get that um bread with them. Just get that one right there. I was trying to get one with no freaking seeds on it. I don't like these little seeds that they be having on here. They're dry. Yeah, they do. They dry the bread out. But it's going to be loaded with butter anyway. So it should be fine. So now we are about to get an onion and a bell pepper. Oh, I should get some of that Publix chicken, but I'm on a budget. Am I the only one that is broke right now for the models? And I didn't even get to get all my kids everything they wanted, but I got the main thing that they wanted, so that's cool with me. Now you go ahead and get the um bell pepper, please. Oh, look, here goes some of my beer. Yeah, just grab one of them. Make sure you get me a good looking one too. And then over there, get me a yellow onion. That's fine. Let me see. This fine. Which one should we get? Should we get this one or this one? The skinny or the tough? Let's get big mom. Let's get big girl. <laughs> big girl might be packing more flavor. Everything is better big, including me. I'm just kidding. Okay. Go ahead and get me an onion. Go ahead and put it in the what you call them? 
in the what's it called? I'm in the bag. And okay, so now I'm back. My bad, y'all. I'm working off my phone, so sometimes I be running out of. Oops. I be running out of space real fast. So I be having to go back and I be having to delete and go back and delete and go back and delete. And it is so time consuming. But I'm going to do it. Okay, so now I am going to get these. Sorry. I'm going to go ahead and get these diced tomatoes. I get the ones that's... Um, basil garlic and herb and i only get the hunts not saying that um you know another brand wouldn't be good but this is just the brand that i like so and now the only thing we have to get next is some uncle john sausage what you gonna eat it and you gonna enjoy it why you said please tell me we're not finna eat that? Because I wanna see I have all these spaghetti. Oh. <laughs> I, thought we was eating spaghetti. I was gonna say, girl, since when you don't eat that? Can bread. Yeah. Also, I just can raisin bread. How do you make canned bread? I don't know, but get that nasty tail stuff away from me. All right, y'all, so I am back. I ended up getting some soap. I got five cans of these. I got two packs of the Uncle John sausage. Um, so it could be a lot. I had to get me a puff and just some hygiene products and some band-aids. And now we're about to go ahead and get checked out and I will see y'all when I get back in the car. Okay, so I am walking out of Publix now. I just, I don't know, maybe it's gonna get ready to be my time of the month soon, but I just got so sad all of a sudden. I don't know if it's just me, but it seems like when you get grown, this time of the year just do not feel good no more. Like, especially like, when you're struggling financially, the kids expect so much out of you. And let's be real. Sometimes your kids don't even give you what you expect out of them. But it just can be so frustrating and so sad around this time of the year. I'm literally, I ain't going to lie, y'all. I'm, I'm working tons of overtime and I'm doing a lot to just stay afloat. So if there's anybody out there that's going through something similar, just only thing I can say is just keep, just keep pushing. Don't give up as hard as it may be to not give up. Cause baby, I give up every day, at least 12 times a day, but don't give up. I'm about to get ready to drive home. I'll probably cry on the way there and then when I get back, I'll be ready to cook. So, I'll see y'all in a little bit. Bye. All right, y'all. So, I'm back. I actually didn't get a chance to cry in the car because my daughter, she in the car with me. So, you know how we hold it together around our kids. But, I don't know. I'm just... I may not even post this video. I don't know. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. But, I'm just literally just so, like... I don't know, maybe it's because I'm getting older in age or I don't know. Maybe I'm supposed to get my cycle. And that's another thing, too. I haven't had a um, period in the last two months, but my tubes tied. I took a pregnancy test. It, it said I wasn't pregnant. And then I'm looking it up. Am I premenopausal? What is going on? My hormones have been, I don't know, maybe it's the time of the year. Maybe it's grief. I don't know, but I am on a emotional roller coaster and I'm really like, I don't know if it's somebody else out there that's going through the same thing. It's just like holding on, but at the same time, it's like, ugh, like, dang, how long can you really, can you really hold on? I'm dead for real. Not trying to be on the list of God's strongest warriors next year. I don't want to be that. I'm so tired of being strong. I am so tired, 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 tired of being strong. And 
maybe people i don't know maybe it's somebody else that feel this same way comment down below if you have just been in your feels these past few days and again i know my hormones are probably just going crazy i haven't gotten a period i'm not pregnant please god don't let me be pregnant i cannot afford to be pregnant again that would be the worst 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 thing that could ever happen to me right now for me to be pregnant please god no i tie my tubes for a reason i'm just mm -mm. but yeah like i said i am i'm i'm holding it together i'm barely holding it together i'm trying to come up with a plan to try to tackle down some of this debt from the holidays from my birthday from just not being in the mood i'm i typically like i said I, I i mentioned this in a previous video i like to work a lot of overtime because um i expect for somebody walking past my car he probably looking like at me like who the hell is this lady talking to my business but i i like to work a lot of overtime that way i can have a lot of extra money to do the things that i like to do for myself and for my children and right now i'm a little i'm 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 slacking off because i just i haven't been in the mood but i'm slowly going to get back to where i was i'm trying i'm trying so hopefully january 1st i'm trying to drop new content i'm trying to get more consistent and i'm trying to really 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 do it so please if you can drop me some motivation down below please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel um i'm about to go up here i'm about to whip up this quick little poor man's meal and show y'all how i do that for again for the people who really don't get all them stamps and you trying to just come up with something real quick for your kids to eat i'm about to get ready to show y'all how to whip up something real 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 good and real quick and real feeling because you know them kids they be quick to say, oh i'm still hungry i'm still hungry i'm starving like we buying our food with cash stop looking at your friends mine and theirs because you see they had a big old crab or with lobster tails steak potato shrimp alfredo and 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 all all them things sound delicious don't get me wrong but mama can't afford it so we about to go up here and whip up what we can afford i'm about to pull myself together and we about to cook this food so let's go okay so first things first you're going to start um by browning your onions and your bell pepper get them real good and fragrant and then you're gonna drop your meat okay so now you have your sausages in there i'm going to just put a little bit of seasoning. Okay, so now I just seasoned it and I'm about to let this cook down and then we'll add our tomatoes. Okay, so my sausages are cooking down. This is how they looking so far. I'm gonna let these cook a little bit longer and then I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna add my tomatoes. Okay, so now my sausages are about done. So I'm adding my tomatoes. I'm gonna go ahead and use all the cans that I purchased earlier. So I'm gonna drop all of those. Okay, so now I got my sausages and my tomatoes. I seasoned with a little bit of complete garlic powder. And this is what it looks like when it cooks all down. Only thing you have to do now is just make some white rice and we can make our Cuban bread. Okay, so this is the finished product. Quick little something to whip up. Um, comment down below if you try this. Or uh, shoot, you can comment down below if you think it look nasty. But again, thank you so much for watching. Bye.